Today, I have the pleasure of interviewing analyst Chris Thompson from eResearch. How are you today? I'm great, Tracy. How are you? And before I tell everybody about this stock that went up 300% this last year and to which stock and to which the buy recommendation has the stock tripling again, let me just ask you, Chris, where do people go to register to get your updates? They can just go to eresearch.com and they can get updates. Uh, we have a newsletter that goes out and all the reports are on the website and can be downloaded for free. So now drum roll. <laughs> who have you started or who have you just initiated coverage with? Please tell us what company this is. Yeah, it's a data communications management. Uh, it's a, the ticker is DCM on the uh, Toronto Stock Exchange. And they are a Canadian based communications and marketing solutions company. So they provide online and offline uh, print and communication solutions for uh, some of the largest corporations in, in Canada. And of course, I've read your research report. I'm a fan. I love mm -hmm. your writing, Chris. And the thing that was most interesting to me was, first of all, I didn't know about the company. And they did uh, what in revenue last year? Did I read that right? $249 million? Yeah, well, they did. Well, in 2020, they did $259 million, And this year, that's a little bit less. Uh, we're estimating about $245 million, you know, because of the impacts of COVID. Uh, you know, some of their larger clients aren't uh, getting in, uh, as much material. Uh, as before, but uh, yeah, they're they're a, it's a, a pretty good sized revenue company for the Canadian market. Well, I believe your buy recommendation was for three dollars. Is that correct? Three dollars and sixty cents. Can you tell us how you came to that conclusion? Yeah, so for this company, uh, I did a blended uh, valuation by looking at both a, a five year DCF at uh, seven times uh, their EBITDA in twenty twenty six. I looked at a revenue multiple looking at next year's revenue and an EBITDA multiple looking at next year's EBITDA. And I blended it together to get a $3.60 price target. Uh, currently, the stock is trading at a little more than a dollar. So you're right in, in the fact that it is a, it is a triple estimate. Um, uh, but I'm pretty confident that this company uh, is heading in the right direction. Well, I don't want you to give away all the good stuff from this research <laughs> report. Um, however, can you tell us maybe a couple of competitive advantages that DCM has that should get us as investors to take a look at this particular story. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. One, one thing they have is they have, uh, you know, 2,500 clients. So that's the one thing that they have. So they have a, a large client base and they also work with a lot of large corporations. So 70 of the top hundred corporations in Canada. And why is that important is because their solutions are very sticky within the organization. It's not just that they're providing print solutions. It's, it's, their, it's their part of their business workflow. That's important. Um, and so that's where you get the sticky revenue, this recurring revenue uh, that's at their base. Uh, the second part of it is that they've had a lot of digital technology that they haven't really been selling to their clients. Uh, and, and I think there's a large opportunity for what's called in the business, the digital asset management side of the business, or DAM, you know, and I think there's a large upside right now that could be much higher revenue, higher margin revenue for the company going forward. Well, damn, I wish I'd known about the <laughs> stock last year. However, I'm very delighted that you brought it to our attention. And for those of you out there that would like to learn more or secure this research report, go to eresearch.com. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, Tracy.